Yo guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can get your processors from looking like this all the way down to this. It's very simple and by doing this you're going to have smoother gameplay, lower latency and higher frames. So all the things you'll need in this video are going to be in my discord server under the free tweaks section so join my discord and we'll go from there. But before we do any of the tweaks we're going to be creating a restore point so you just need to click the windows key and search up restore and create a restore point here. Click create, name it whatever you want so I'll just name it tweaks and click create. Once it's created, the restore point will be saved and we can start with the tweaks. So once you join my discord, just go over to the free tweaks section and we're going to be using all the things inside here to make us have lower processors and give us an overall smoother gameplay. So the first thing I'm going to be covering is the auto runs exe here. Just click on the blue and download and it should download instantly. So I have it right here in my tweak pack. So if we drag it out here. You just want to open this as an administrator and it should bring up a bunch of apps that turn on when your PC starts up. Now everything in here is what loads up when your PC starts up and more or less everything will be ticked. So you're going to go through and untick all of the unnecessary apps you don't want to open when your PC turns on. So I know a lot of you won't want like epic games spotify steam all that stuff there is some important ones that i'm going to go through as well so like all of these that don't have any pictures and the description all this i'm going to go through all this once you've disabled all the unnecessary things like epic games microsoft edge all that so once you've gone through and disabled all the main apps you're going to want to disable all of these Google Chrome installers and Microsoft Edge installers. So anything that says installer after it, you don't want this to open because this is just going to give you higher processors and it's going to cause you more lag in game. You're also going to want to disable anything that says Edge in it. So IT, IET, O Edge, BHO, you want to disable this. If you scroll down a bit, Microsoft Edge update, you're going to disable that. Opera GX auto update, you're going to disable that. You can disable all of these NVIDIA things inside here because this is just crash reporters and you don't want these running because it's going to cause you more lag. If you scroll down a bit more, you see more edge updates here. You're going to want to disable FVSVC here, the NVIDIA frame view. You don't want this. Google updater, you want to disable these. If you scroll down a bit more, you have your Steam client service. You don't want this opening. This is going to give you like 10 processors when you turn your PC on if this is running. Scroll down a bit more, you see there's a lot of files here. You're going to want to disable any virtual audio devices you have inside here. Keep all the others, but if you have any virtual audio, disable these. Then if you scroll down and you see Internet Explorer, you're going to want to disable this. After you've gone through all of these and disabled all the unnecessary things, you don't have to click file or save. You just close off and it'll automatically save. And these won't open anymore when you turn your PC on. Now, if you go back to my Discord server and you see MSI Utility, you just want to download this and it'll do the same thing as last time. Just drag it onto your desktop and then we'll open it and I'll go through the settings in there. So once you've got this on your desktop, you're just going to right click, run this as an administrator and it'll bring a box up that looks like this. All you need to do in here is find your GPU, so NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti for me, and where it says interrupt priority, it's going to click this and you're going to set it to high. Then it's going to click apply in the top right, and that's all you need to do inside MSI Utility. Now we're going to go back to my Discord server, and where it says S powers underscore x64 exe, you're going to download this, drag it onto your desktop. And we're going to be going through the settings in there. Now this one is extremely simple. You just want to run it as an administrator and click ultimate performance. It'll either say high performance or ultimate performance. Whichever one you have, ultimate performance is better. So if you have that, then make sure you click ultimate. But if you only have high, you just click high performance and then you click the tick 
and you can close off this. If this video did help you out guys make sure you drop a like and subscribe and if you want a one to one tweaking session where I'll fully optimize and overclock your PC to its max potential feel free to create a ticket in my discord server. But anyways thanks for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.